what's up everyone? Welcome to What's in Your Bag. I'm your host Melissa New with my co-host here, Mr. Chase Reynolds Hi. of Lens Rentals. How are you? I'm doing great. Good. Let's just talk as if Mr. Joe McNally is not sitting right next Ooh. to us. Please carry on. <laughs> I'll just, I can go to sleep standing up. Good. So this is early issue. in the morning. It is. Are you bringing your feisty this early in the morning? We'll see Melissa. It depends on how good you are. Oh, okay. So well, yes. game face on. <laughs> we want to talk about gear. Everyone talks about their work and their shoots and their clients, but I, I, I mean, it's just exhausting. It's just exhausting. <laughs> it's exhausting. <laughs> I'm just You know the classic photographer quote? Bro, show me know? pictures. Um, I know. That's enough about me. Let's talk about what you think about my work. Exactly. <laughs> you know, that's exactly. a classic exactly. photographerism. You so know? enough about you, Joe. Let's talk about your work right now. Oh, Jesus. So, I, you know, client work and FedEx and this and that. Let's talk about personal work. When you're... I mean, he talked about being on vacation, mm -hmm. but when you think in the shower or in your bed and you're like, I am dying to do this shoot or this shoot or this shoot, what's kind of your go-to? So let's say you just met an, an amazing subject that you're dying to do something, whatever it is that Joe McNally thinks in your head. When you think of doing that gear, do you go to your Nikon D4S? What, what's kind of your go-to? I mean, give me a scenario of something maybe you've done lately with your personal work. Well, uh pursuant to my overall personality, my answer is going to be relatively boring. And it's not... Um, well, add an accent. Maybe it'll be more, okay. more interesting. <laughs> it's, I use camera from old country. It's a Nova Cybersco Flex. It is a wonderful camera, a bit on the slow side. But, um, no, um, so far we've yeah. gotten Texas. We've gotten... What was that? I don't know, a, a, a Russian or Eastern European. I like it. Yeah, Keep it going. Slap like me it. really hard. Um, but no, you see, my choices of cameras and lenses are pretty normal. I don't, you know, I don't. I'm not a football guy, for instance, or a sidelines kind of photographer. Mm -hmm. like my go-to lens every day that I use is a 200 to 400 or something like that. Mm -hmm. I'm a middle of the road. You know, there's three lenses that go out with us all the time, and that's 1424, 2470, 70 to 200. Okay, we have a D4S that's a workhorse camera. We have a backup to that. And then I've also upgraded to the DA10. So depending on the nature of the job, you know, if I'm in a studio and I'm in control of the subject and I'm not uh, shooting over fast or I'm not in a hectic situation, the DA10 would be the camera of choice for that. If I'm out there running and gunning on the street or doing a helicopter job or something like that, the D4S is the more likely choice because you're not gonna buffer that camera right. very easily. You, consecutive high is very, very fast, you know? So when you are maximizing a situation that perhaps you're in, in terms of, um, the speed or the efficiency that you have to bring to bear in a very compressed amount of time, maybe that influences your choice of camera. Sure. I just did a couple of Halloween illustrations uh, that were you know, going to be used as advertisements. So I used the DA10 because I wanted the resolution. So those kinds of very mundane concerns about assignments are what drives your camera choices. It's not kind of pie in the sky. Sure. Well, Joe, tell us where we can find your work who have not seen Joe's work, I would definitely check it out. What is your website? Uh, www.midnighttatler.com. No, okay. <laughs> I <laughs> You're knew from it. Vegas. I knew <laughs> it. Something. You uh, never know if he's serious. You just uh, never know. I'm just... M-I-D... I'm going to I'm going to go with the obvious here. Yeah, joemcnally.com. I write a blog, joemcnally.com backslash blog. Uh, we have, in, ter in terms of gear, there's a, uh, uh, you know, a hot link on my blog, uh, Joe's Camera Bag. Just click on that. Nice. Basically everything that we use or are current with, that's right there on those pages. Excellent. And it, definitely check out his work, but I am a big fan of his writing. And it's interesting to find out that you were going to be a writing major, or that's what you studied. So he has such a brilliant way of writing, has such a good way of teaching, and really puts things into... Um, good perspective and really something that I can relate with. So thank you for all that you put into your, your work and your writing. And we talked a lot about gear, D800, D810, lots of lenses. I definitely check out the folks over at Lens Rentals. Chase is a great guy. His team is working hard. You know, you don't have to buy all these things. Not everyone has the Joe McNally budget, but definitely check out LensRentals.com and, and try out some of these gear. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you. No thank sarcastic you. remarks to, to close out. No, I just it's just been swell to see you again, it's Melissa. It's been so <laughs> swell, Joe. <laughs>